Hello, uh, uh, today's topic is uh, deep vein thrombosis or blood clots, you know, uh, or also known as blood clot in the legs, you know, or also known as DVT. So these are the different names used for the same condition. Uh, but there are both superficial and deep veins in the limbs and extremities, uh, which means in arms and legs, you know. So a blood clot in the deep veins uh, is a concern because it can cause life-threatening complications. Uh, a blood clot, uh, which is known as a uh, thrombus, uh, in the deep venous system of the leg becomes dangerous if a piece of the blood clot breaks off and travels through the blood stream and through the heart and into the pulmonary arteries, forming a pulmonary embolism. So a person may not have signs and symptoms uh, of a small pulmonary embolism. Uh, so pulmonary embolism means a blood clot in the lungs. Uh, but if there is a large embolism, you know, it can be fatal. And the risk factors for the blood clot forming uh, uh, include like immobility or genetic ten uh, tendency you know, towards blood clotting or injury to the veins or adjacent tissues uh, uh, occurs, you know. Uh, so the symptoms of the deep vein thrombosis uh, include like um, pain, uh, swelling, uh, warmth, uh, tenderness, uh, redness of the leg or arm, you know. So these are the most common symptoms associated with the uh, deep vein uh, thrombosis, you know. Uh, the diagnosis of the uh, deep vein thrombosis can be suggested by blood tests and confirmed by ultrasound or other imaging tests like MRI or CT scan, you know. Uh, the treatment uh, typically involves uh, blood thinning medications uh, known as anticoagulants, you know, unless they cannot be used uh, in patients uh, where it is contraindicated, you know. Uh, so in that uh, situation, an uh, inferior vena cava filter is potentially considered just to uh, take out that uh, blood clot, you know. So the complications of DVT include like a pulmonary embolism and uh, post uh, 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 Felbitic syndrome, you know. So there are other types of uh, thrombosis such as uh, cerebral venous thrombosis or portal vein thrombosis or um, uh, cavernous uh, sinus thrombosis, you know. Uh, so that's a brief note about the uh, uh, deep vein thrombosis. If you need more information about this one or any other medical condition, you can visit our website www.diseasesandtreatment.com. Thank you and goodbye.